victorious ones. Imagine that somebody paid off your house for you, paid off your car, paid off your bills, paid in full. Would you then go back and pay for the house, pay for the car, and repay those bills? Of course not. Well, that's what Jesus has done for us. Jesus has paid every debt. He died so that you can be healthy. He died so that we can be free. Okay? Jesus already paid the penalty, paid the price. So all we have to do is receive it by grace. In the name of Jesus. We don't have to do any rituals or routines. All we have to do is follow the Most High God. All we have to do is say, yes, I accept the gift. I accept salvation. I accept life and life more abundantly. I accept the keys of the kingdom of God. I accept life and life more abundantly. I accept the Holy Spirit in my heart. I accept the word of God. All you have to do is say yes. And you don't have to pay for anything. Now that's love. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him will never perish, but will have eternal life. Jesus paid it all. And all we have to do is be sons and daughters of the most high God, humble ourselves, read the word, obey the word, follow the Holy Spirit. That's all we have to do. There's no religion, just relationship that we're inscribing the palm of God's hands. That we are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation. God called us up out of darkness into his marvelous light. And all we have to do is say yes. Yes, Lord. I accept Jesus Christ as my personal Lord and Savior. I surrender my life to you, Father God. And God will bless your socks off. Ask me how I know. Now go ahead and walk in your healing, walk in your peace, walk in goodness, walk in faithfulness, walk in gentleness, walk in favor, walk in honor, walk in power, authority, and dominion. Go ahead and walk in your blessing. Christ paid for you to have it. You don't have to pay for it again. It's already been paid in full. And you are a child of God, a royal priest. So fix your crown and receive your beautiful crown for your ashes. Beauty for ashes, that's your portion. That's your birthright on repeat in the name of Jesus.